taught all the kids how to read. A good old-fashioned house nigga, they called him. But he was beaten just the same. Now, it wasn't uh, the, the master of the house, who my father loved, in a way, but his brother, whom my father hated with an almighty passion. He, he'd beat the slaves almost nightly. Whip them. Rape them. One night, my father was getting a whooping for the crime of being born by this horrible bastard when his sister-in-law, the, the master's wife, walks in. Now, fearing for my father's life, she told her brother-in-law to stop. Well, not only did he not stop, he beat her too. Next day, his brother, the master, shot him dead. The whole plantation cheered. The master gave my father his dead brother's watch and told him as he did so, time will catch up with us all. A year later, he set them free and hanged himself the very next night. My father gave me that watch. Beautiful, big pocket watch it was. And now, I've gone and lost it fleeing Blackwater. When I get some spare money, I'm gonna buy myself another one to honor both my father and them folks that saved his life. You okay, Lenny? Yeah. Lemoyne wouldn't be my first choice, but this is a good spot. It's just for now. <laughs> 